Trini Girl Natural. Hi everyone! Sometimes you're in a rush and you just need to get your wash day done. So how do you do it? I'm here to let you know. <laughs> so basically I need a reset. I need to wash my hair. But I don't want to spend all day. What do I do? So what I do is cleanse. And then I condition. And then that's it. I go. Basically I flip the script and make the conditioner into a conditioner only wash and go and then I take off. So this is how I do my fastest wash day. So I start off with using my favorite co-wash, Camille Rose Caramel Co-wash, which I love. It's pretty thick <laughs> and creamy and just rich and super moisturizing. So you've seen my co-wash routine before, I just kind of get it to my roots, give my scalp a good scrub. I sometimes follow up with the shampoo brush and kind of give it a good scrub with that too. So once my scalp is clean, I just work the co-wash down through my strands. This co-wash is so conditioning and so moisturizing. I'm really not scared at all to work it through my strands. I just go for it. <laughs> so it's like a conditioner and it's cleansing. It blows my mind really, my HG co-wash. I did somehow manage to put a lot as usual, so I'm kind of coated in it, but my hair just felt really great and moisturized after. I rinse it all out and my hair is just super moisturized, it's defined, it's shiny, it's condition after using this co-wash as you can see it's all set up now for the main event I guess which is the conditioning <laughs> so I'm using the Eden Essentials conditioner I was really excited to try it out it's pretty thick um, and I don't usually like thick conditioners, but it did do a good job in terms of moisture and definition. And the slip was good. It wasn't the best slip, but it was good enough to get it through my hair. So I really enjoyed using this product and I would also repurchase this. So you've seen my conditioning routine. It's basically a task just getting it everywhere. But once I do that, then I start working it in with the raking and the smoothing and so on. So all of this is like my usual conditioning process. But once it's completely worked in, that's where I do my flip script, script flip, and I start doing my conditioner only wash and go, which is basically just conditioning my hair, but I just shake it at the end <laughs> and I go. But in this case, I did my um, oil my ends and spritz aloe vera juice on it. The oil and the aloe vera juice is optional, but I also just like doing that as well, just to add some moisture and protect my hair a little bit healthy hair practices kind of thing. Well, I skip it sometimes as well. So once the aloe vera juice is in, that's my final product. I just do another smooth and rake. Then I put my clips in and shake and that's it. So, yay, I'm all done. My fast wash day, cleanse, condition, and go. <laughs> Bye. This is the result. This is, um, this is like a multi-day result but this is my conditioner only wash and go a lot of times when i do videos you'll see me say well i can leave it like this or i can add gel this is the leave it like this my shrinkage is pretty similar my hair doesn't really shrink like it frizzes but it doesn't the overall shape stays the same if you know what i mean so it's kind of an s and the s stays like that it just is more frizzy if i don't use gel so that's basically it. But I love it because it's just soft and fluffy. It has more volume, like even on day one. Usually I come on at like a day three to film because that's when my hair has the most body. But with this, I probably could have filmed on a day one. This is like day two, I think. And I just love the body, the shape, the softness, the volume. 
love. The only downside of doing this is that it just doesn't last as long. So I did this because I know I have a short week and I have to wash Wednesday anyway. But if I didn't have to wash Wednesday, I'm not sure I could get through the week. I could actually probably try, but I'm not sure. So when I do gel, I know I can get a week, I know I can get two weeks. When I don't do gel, it's just a hope. Usually, when I'm doing these, I use a glycerin-free conditioner just to eliminate stress. Because if you have one product in your hair, you really don't want it to be fluctuating with glycerin. But since today I have a special treat for you guys, I am using a conditioner with glycerin. Eden Essentials Citrus Fusion Conditioner. So I also wanted to come on and review this, as well as talk about my fast wash day. <laughs> it is really thick, it's not really moving. <clears throat> so those of us who need like a little bit of a water assist, <laughs> for me water doesn't really go into my hair that much. I had to keep adding water to get my hair wet enough to work it in when I was working it in. So I like lighter products just because the water is already kind of built in. If the water isn't built in, I have to add it. <laughs> my hair doesn't retain, doesn't hold on to water, like doesn't get wet. So that was a bit of a struggle for me. But overall, it was really moisturizing. It did a good job defining my curls. I mean, you know, conditioner only, multi-day. I slept on this, I can't complain. I did go heavy on it, and I did use pretty much the whole thing. <laughs> but I can see myself getting like a use and a half from this if I didn't go crazy. I definitely recommend it. I think you should check it out. I'm very moisturizing, slip okay. And did a good job. Not wash ago. So <laughs> I just did that again just because it felt so good. I love the volume. Like I don't often have this much volume. So when I do, I'm like, yeah girl. Yeah girl. <laughs> so another week of big hair. I think my hair was pretty big last week. So I'm a happy camper. I hope you enjoyed the demo. I hope you enjoyed seeing how I do a quick wash day, how I do a conditioner only wash day, and seeing this brand new product. <laughs> I have a lot of stuff coming up. It's going to be really fun. So yeah, just kind of come along for the ride, and I will see you in the next one. Bye!